Let's wait for some people to join. Let's see if I did this right. I screwed up the last live stream I did a couple of seconds ago, so we'll see if anybody joins this one. Oh man, it's so cold. All right, looks like we have a couple people coming in. Hey, what's up guys? How's everybody doing? Been a long time since I've gone live. Figured, uh, what the hell, let's do it here. I'm at the end of my um, my long weekend excursion out into Pennsylvania. So um, I decided to, uh, on a whim, stop at this place here. And uh, it's shocking. 100% vacant, except for once, it's like a bouncy castle place that's open on the weekends. Um, let's go in. Let me show you guys what's going on here because I just filmed it and I don't expect this video to go live the fully, um, uh, produced one. I don't expect that to go live for a long time. So here is the Columbia colonnade in, uh, Pennsylvania. So as you all can see, there's nothing. There's a few mall walkers, um, but that's it. There's nothing else in here. And from what I hear, they're going to be uh, redeveloping this place. So it's completely empty. There's nothing inside. do a lap. Also, I just want to apologize for having no new content yet in 2022. Um, I've been real busy. Um, but uh, I definitely have new videos coming soon, very soon but I needed to take this trip because there's a few places on this trip that I filmed that I don't think are gonna make it to 2023. So I needed to film them, uh, but new videos are definitely coming. Stay, stay, stay tight, they're coming. Chris, I'm just really cold. I've been, I'm not getting sick, I feel fine. I've just been out in the cold for the last few days with my drone and all sorts of stuff. I've been, it's just been a, a long last few days, but I, I feel fine. So I appreciate the concern though. But look at this, this is crazy, look at this. I don't know if you can hear it. It's just like water dripping real hard inside here. This is the Columbia Colonnade outside of Bloomsburg, PA. No clue who owns it. I've done no research on this place yet. 
but it's just mall walkers all over the place. Melinda, I'm tired. Um, this is the uh, seventh mall that I filmed in the last few days, and I'm, I'm tired. I'm, I'm definitely tired. It's been it's been a long trip, a lot of driving. I started out in uh, near the border of Ohio, and I made it over here. Um, this is the last place I'm doing, and then I'm going to head south to Baltimore. But it's been it's been a long trip, super long trip. nothing. There's nothing open in here. They have the saddest plants. This is the Columbia Colonnade. And I, I'm, I'm just trying not to talk loudly. It feels awkward talking. And, and for the record, I will be doing a fully produced piece on this mall, but it's not going to come out for a while. It's not going to be out for a while. Um, but that one's going to include like drone footage and I hope, I haven't checked the, um, uh, any FAA restrictions, but it'll, you know, be like a normal X-Log. Um, no, not a GNC. The GNC moved across to uh, this other shopping center. Um, there, I, I saw a GNC on my way in, but it's not in this mall. It's cold. The, it, actually, let's go see. Here's the thermostat, let's see. It's uh, about 55 in here, 55 degrees. I love those plants. They're so cool. Yeah, it's just warm enough. Somebody was telling me the other day who was in here um, from the Dead Mulsa Discord server, they were telling me that the uh, thermostat hit 48 the other day. So this place is, this place is cold. It's like, yeah, it's just, just warm enough um, for the pipes not to freeze. How psychedelic is that? Hey, Gru. Guten Tag. No, there's no, there's no GNC. There's no Bath and Body Works. There's nothing. There's literally nothing open in this store. Literally the only thing that's apparently open is this bouncy place like where they inflate things kids can roll around on or whatever, I don't know. But apparently that's open on Saturdays or Sundays, I don't know. But there's nothing. So down at the end here, you can see a Dunham Sports and they closed off the mall access. Down at this end, you can see a furniture store. They closed off the mall access. That's it. Um, there's also a gym. There's a Planet Fitness, I think. No mall access. So. No, there's no food, there's nothing. It's 100% vacant. Nothing, there's nothing. Hey, what's up, Rick? Uncle Rick. Everybody say hi to Rick. He's in the chat. Um, so for those of you that just joined, this is the Columbia 
Colonnade. Uh, and this is right outside of Bloomsburg, Pennsylvania. Let me just see if this exit here is open or not. Let's see. It's open. Oh good, they have cones set up to tell you that it's icy. Oh my god, it is totally, it's like, I'm gonna eat shit on this. <laughs> oh yeah, they don't even have the name of the mall on the facade. All right, I'm walking on snow, it's safer. So for those of you that just joined, this is the Columbia Colonnade outside of Bloomsburg, Pennsylvania. I'll, re I'll edit the live stream title. I just kind of typed that on a whim. Uh, I'll edit the title so that it has the name of all in it. But once again, this is, um, I'm here filming this place so that I can produce like a full X log on it, which isn't going to come out for quite a while. Um, and I'm at the end of a long trip and I haven't really um, haven't been able to get anything out on my channel for you guys so far this year. I figured this would be a good opportunity to just say hi and to wish you all a happy new year. But let's go back into the mall. I'm freezing. Um, and let's check this place out. Exactly chamomile. No, I don't, I don't travel every month for malls. I, I take trips here and there. But I have a day job every day of the week, and I play concerts, and I do this when I can. So I'm building out my backlog right now. Hey, Donna. Look at this. There's nothing. I really don't know another way to like, I, I don't know another way to, to portray just how empty this place is. Like this is nuts. This is nuts. It's very clean. This is the Columbia Colonnade in Bloomsburg, Pennsylvania. Hey, Jim, doing good. No, it's not moldy. Um, leaky, definitely leaky, but not moldy. Um, I'm trying to figure out what this is. I think this is, um, I'm pretty sure this is like for the VA, like some healthcare thing. I'm pretty sure this has to do with the VA. Because there's these like, these buildings or these storefronts that have keyed access all over the place. Wow, it's dry. This place is incredible. Um, just FYI, if you guys want to keep up with me, uh, join the Discord. I'm, I'm there every day. Um, so if you want to chat with me and you don't see me posting on YouTube, I'm definitely still around. But I'm just either busy filming, playing concerts or whatever. Oh my God, Charlene, thank you. And I, I think Dan Bell rocks. He's awesome. I can't wait until he gets back from his trip or he might be back. Maybe we can hang out. Thank you, Charlene. I, I appreciate that. No mold. Um, but again, join the um, join the, the Discord server 
just go to discord.gg slash dmod. Links are in all my descriptions. Uh, that's how you can talk to me whenever. Look at this ceiling detail. Oh, it's amazing. Yeah, Rick, we need to get on a podcast. ASAP. There's shit to talk about. Oh, hi, Flea. Flea, I actually lived in College Park when I went to University of Maryland College Park for school. I did my master's there. I think, I like how there's like this mirror, but I don't see it in any other part of the mall. This is the uh, management office, but I don't think there's anything to manage. Wow. Oh, this is the memo. Yeah, this is, um, this is the memo, pretty much. Sorry, dropped out for a sec. Um, I saw somebody ask if I ever get kicked out. Um, I, I did. Uh, I've, I've been kicked out a few times. Um, but just recently, I was just kind of walking around um, at some other place in Pennsylvania. And I, I got there at night. So like it was the night that I, I got into town and I decided to take my chances because there was a movie theater attached to it. And in my experience, when there's a movie theater, you can, you know, get into the mall after hours. So I did just that. Um, so I filmed and it was great. But the next day I went back for more footage and the janitor, ugh, she saw me. And she started screaming at me like, hey, hey, hey. And she's like, I'm gonna call the cops on you. I don't know what you're doing, but I'm gonna call the cops on you. And so, <laughs> so that was, that was that. Hello, Andre Art. Yeah, I totally got a security guard. Okay, so th the, the night that I got there, I was like, to be fair, I was outside of the abandoned Kmart in like the garden section. And um, like I was filming just a bit like on how, to, how I got into the place. So it was kind of a little sus, it was a little creepy. And then she was locking the doors. And when, I, when she was locking the door, she saw me kind of like lurking around the, uh, the Kmart. Uh, and she was like, hey, what's your deal? And I'm like, I'm just making a little video for YouTube. And then the next day when I went back, I think she recognized me. And I'm sort of dressed right now like like, like Ukrainian assassin. Like here, I don't know if you can see this. But like, okay, I've got khakis on today. But I've had like black pants on all week. And a North Face. So like I was just decked out in all black. And uh, I looked like... <laughs> looked like what Russians think that, you know, like Eastern Russians might think uh, an assassin looks like. But, um, I mean, you know, that was my fault. <sighs> so, I guess she wanted to kick me out for, or she wanted to call the cops on me for looking suspicious. Whatever. Uh, <laughs> whatever. I saw somebody give me five pounds. Thank you. I appreciate that. No, I haven't been in Greengate. I love the ceiling fixtures. I love the, the treatment on the ceiling here with the plants and the pastels. It's so cool. Rick, there's a couple of mall walkers in here. Look, you can see them. There's mall walkers.
Yikes. Sorry, people, I keep getting calls and when I get a call it like, it pauses the stream. Sorry about that. This mall is, I don't know why it's open. I don't know why it's open. I know that there's redevelopment efforts that are in the works. Um, I, I don't know why it's open, but it's open. So here we are. Hey, Kush Luke, um, I have a drone and I pilot it and I'm about to pilot it inside this place. El Plagiato. Thank you so much for, for the donation. Here, let me show you the place that apparently keeps this place open on the weekends. I fly a Mavic Air 2. Shoots wonderful footage. Nothing. Not a thing is open here. You know, half of me wants to say it's like a mall walker's paradise. Like this place is on paper should be great for mall walkers, but it's actually kind of cold in here. It's in like the lower 50s inside of this mall. And I think they're keeping it warm enough just to um, keep the pipes from freezing. But here's the, the one place that's open on the weekends. And again, for those that just joined, this is the Columbia Colonnade in uh, Bloomsburg, PA. So there's the Dunham Sports that's closed off to the mall. There's a dance school that might open certain days, I'm not sure. But this is the bouncy place that is open for kids. Yeah, you see? So like they inflate these things and kids like jump around and roll around on these things, I don't know. It's massive, it's huge. But yeah, that's this place. It's closed. Um, and uh, a full X-Log, fully produced X-Log is gonna be coming on this place. Hey Paula, thank you so much. It was awesome hanging out with you and Anthony uh, this past weekend. But uh, yeah. This will be like, who knows, X-Log, whatever. I have no idea. I have no idea what number this is gonna be. This is gonna happen a while down the line. But um, Columbia Colonnade, Bloomsburg, Pennsylvania, um, formerly the Columbia Mall, and it still has signage that show the Columbia Mall. Yeah, this place is toast. Toast. Um, but I mean, I have a ton of episodes that I need to produce. Like a ton of episodes that I, I need to do. Um, I just took this trip so that I could build out my backlog a little bit. Um, th yeah, this trip, this trip was good. I got a lot of really awesome stuff. But um, I'm not exactly sure what my next episode's gonna be. There's a good chance it might be finishing up my New York stuff and uh, the Niagara Falls um, visit. But, uh, but yeah, I just wanted to stop in, say hi, have a quick chat with you guys. Um, and, uh, you know, wish you all a happy new year. Happy 2022. And right now, I'm going to go fly my drone. And I think I might try to fly it inside the mall. What the hell, right? There's nobody in there except mall walkers. They'll be fine. So, um, here's the quite copter ready to go. Um, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to, I'm going to get footage 
like, you know, footage outside. But I think I'm gonna bring the drone inside. And if I do, you'll see it in that episode. You might see it on my second channel, uh, which by the way, I have a second channel that I haven't done anything with in months. Um, it's Quite Studios. But uh, go join the Discord. I'll be on there. I'm on there every day, so you can talk to me whenever. Um, it's in all my descriptions. But I need to go get back to work here. And uh, I need to go pilot the drone to get you guys footage so I can make more episodes. So, love you all. Thank you so much for joining. Happy 2022. And uh, have a 